Um, Will Smith is set to star as Venus and Sir Williams' father, Richard Williams, in the upcoming biopic surrounding his life. It looks really good, actually. But it seems like Amanda Seals isn't a fan of Will portraying the role of the father. In response to the trailer, Amanda stated, Will Smith is playing Richard Williams. Also, why is this film about Richard Williams? Now, Amanda received a response from a user that mentioned that her point was weak because Will played the role of uh, Chris Gardner in The Pursuit of Happiness and received an Oscar nomination, even though the actor is a lighter complexion than the character he's playing. Do you think Amanda's response to Will's role is regarding color and colorism? And what are your thoughts on Will portraying the role of Richard Williams? You know, I definitely don't think this is as far-fetched as Zoe Saldana playing Nina Simone. Um, you know, <laughs> we have got to be careful. Will is a good actor. Will right. is an A-list actor. Uh, you know, several questions to be answered. So why is this story about Richard Williams? Well, there's a story there to be told. You know what I'm saying? There is a story. We know the story somewhat of Venus and Serena, but there is a story to be told for the person that made them Venus and Serena. Now, if her only, you know, real concern is about the color, then I think we've got to be very careful. That's a very slippery slope because just because a person happened to be in real life three shades darker than the person that's playing them in the movie does not mean that that person cannot effectively play the role. And if we are to dispel all this colorism stuff, this, that, and third, then we need to be able to, as viewers, sit down and see the story for what it is and not get caught up in the fact that the daddy was light dark skin and Will is light skin. It, 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 it's a weak argument. If Will is the best man for the job, and we have seen that he is an A-list actor that can do very good work in these roles, then let it be. And not to mention, there are only but so many a-list, brown skin, dark skin actors that are available who have the range. They may not have been available. Don Cheadle is too short and too skinny. Aldous Hodge is too goddamn fine and too tall. Denzel Washington is too damn old and he's somewhere having dinner with Pauletta and Oprah. Will might have been the only one available to take the part. Hell, he ain't got nothing to do since Jada around there fool our line and broke his heart with uh, Algis Alcina and quite as it's kept. She probably ran there with T-Pain and Justin Bieber and everybody else right now. That man needs something to do. And this script came across his table and it gave him something to do. I'm here for Amanda. Go sit down on this one. Al, what do you think? So, you know, to me, Amanda has been one of the most outspoken, social conscious entertainers in the game right now. That's I'm just confused as to why she's talking about this. Amanda, where is your commentary about the baby's homophobic, insensitive attack on the gay community, the LBGTQ community, and those that are living with AIDS? I kind of want to know your perspective on that. Let's talk about that. And also something else that I want to know, I know this is off topic, but something else I want to know. When I looked at all the pictures of Issa Rae's wedding, I didn't see um, Amanda Seals anywhere. So kind of like, why? Well, I wonder why she wasn't at the wedding. That's where my mind is as it relates to Amanda Seals. Well, it's, it came already out. Hit. it's already hit. The cast of Insecure don't F with her. You oh, know, really? it, it, oh yeah, it, it hit on multiple articles. Uh, I'm paraphrasing here. There was a party in Hollywood where the publicist invited all of Insecure. She got to the door and they would not let her in. And wow. then um, I forgot the guy's name, Adonis, Haldonis, something to that effect. Forgive me. He came out and basically say, what do you expect for being a bitch all the time? Nobody wants to be around you. That's why your ass ain't get into the party. So it's known that she is and can be problematic amongst the cookout. Gotcha. All right. All right. Well, we, we have to take a quick break. Um, real quick, Will Smith's a great actor. And, you know, it's not like they got um, the debarge, one of the debarges to play this role where it's super unfeasible. <laughs> or one of those Tyler Perry actors for the <laughs> god-awful damn shows on own. I mean, 
Jesus. <laughs> and I will say this: why why is that movie about Richard Williams? Well, the the I, I, apparently Venus and Serena are EPs on this, so they signed off on it. So it's something All that right. they wanted to do for their dad. So we're gonna take a quick break, and we'll be back with more TGIF. I'm gonna get me a drink. We'll be right back. 